You know, we talk about this all the time. Between family work and life in general, it can be hard to find time to eat right. Yeah, so you turn to supplements like protein powder. It seems like a great way to get the nutrients you need. But do you really know what you're putting into your body? A new report shows hidden dangers in some of the most popular protein powders out there. Switch sides, Mary. Personal trainer Leslie Derrick has made it her mission to stay healthy. You just want to protect the knees. So we brought some popular protein powders to the gym where we asked Leslie and her clients to look at the labels and tell us which of them seemed the best and the worst. You're looking at um, calories, protein, and carbs. And you're not necessarily looking at all, all the ingredients. CleanLabelProject.org is a watchdog for consumers. In the past, they've tested baby food, baby formula, and pet food. So this time they bought 137 of Amazon's top-selling protein powders and sent them off to a lab. What they found was alarming, various toxins in your supplements. Things like heavy metals, lead, arsenic, cadmium, and mercury, antibiotic residues, pesticide residues. Vega Chocolate Protein and Greens was one of the most popular, but it ranks among the worst for arsenic, lead, cadmium, and mercury. The study showed some of the dirtiest results were organic. What we found is that plant-based protein powders had higher levels of arsenic as well as cadmium, which we think comes potentially from contaminated soil. We've seen studies show many of these fillers and metabolic compounds have contributed to certain types of cancers. Maysoon Hamadi is a dietitian. There's really no safe way to validate what is in the, the nutritional supplements. This is Biochem Vanilla Whey, and it was one of the healthiest. Testing showed no detectable levels of arsenic, BPA, lead, or mercury, and it was also one of the cleanest forms of cadmium. We look at the five cleanest products, all of them happen to be whey-based and vanilla-based. All of the women were shocked with the results and are now second-guessing using protein powders. My recommendation would be go natural. So use the eggs, use the dairy, use the meats. So a spokeswoman from Vega told us they have not seen the raw data from the cleanlabel.org testing, but she said, quote, we, however, want to reassure our consumers that we test every single lot of our Vega protein to ensure our products are safe, compliant and nutrient dense and meet our high quality standards. I mean, this happened to us. You went into our pantry and you said, wait a minute here. This made kind of the bad list. How do you know what's in the protein powder? So one of ours in our pantry did actually make the list of the worst ones. So yeah. I told you to stop drinking it. Right. So for those of you wondering if yours is on the list, we put that link to the report that ranks 137 of the most popular. It's on our website, kshb.com. I suggest you go look at it before you drink another protein drink.